What is up, Internet? It is I, Caleb Black, bringing you more Resident Evil 2. I did have to take a little break because I got sick. And I decided that listening to me dry, he dry heave into a microphone may not be the best pleasant Let's Play experience on the Internet. It's better than Dark Side Phil, but I want to do better than better than Dark Side Phil, so at least you don't have to worry about me masturbating in the middle of it. Anyway... When we last left our heroes, I was working to obtain an herbicide to take care of that giant plant in the greenhouse, and I got it mixed, I got it cooled, and now I gotta disperse it. So, uh, yeah. Let's just jump into it, as they say. Now, it's been a while since uh, we heard from our pal. Mr. X. Or as I like to call him, Francis. Or Smiley. So I have a feeling we'll be encountering him soon. I like to think that I have fairly good instincts when it comes to... Horror games, especially Resident Evil games. I've played a lot of them over the yards. Alright. Dispersal cartridge. Let's use it. Dispensing solution now. Did the trick. It did. Warning. You have dispersed a dangerous solution without authorization. Your actions have been locked, and you may be subject to disciplinary measures. Bada bang. Oh! Can I call it or can I call it? Excuse me, no! Oh! Shit. Nope. Nope. No! Okay. <coughs> I need to push my lungs back into place. <clears throat> okay. So I'm gonna need an exit strategy. Fine. 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 Alright. Dispensing solution now. Yes, yes, computer lady. That did the trick. Warning. Shut up, Leon. You have Nobody likes you. And you may be subject to disciplinary measures. You may be subject to disciplinary measures. You poop. Go! Out of the way! Aha!
I'm getting the F out. I hope I'm going the right way. Ah, oh, crap, I can hear him stomping around with his stompy boots. Yeah. Uh. Okay, 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 okay. <sighs> okay. Just gotta... My bearings. <sighs> that was exciting. I'm to hustle the bustle now. I got to cheese it. I need level four clearance for the elevator, don't I? Yep. Of course, it wouldn't Hopefully be that easy. Samples up here. It's like, oh, if I draw the bridge back, there'll be a massive chasm between me and Stompy, and uh, I won't have to worry about him. But no. No, that would be too easy. Another umbrella corpse. I think I said I'd stop doing that, but I lied. Ooh, grenade. Lost my knife. I'm kind of sad about that. Put your bitch in, Leon. Imagine how I feel. Ooh, item box. Uh, don't need to store anything. What do we got here? Oss. There we go. Awesome. Ha 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 good, I can get rid of it. Get out of here. Alright, now that the lights are on, and I've got a little breathing room. Uh, William Birkins inbox. Let's rifle through his emails, shall we? <coughs> From Jane Doyle. Subject, suspending research on G. The Umbrella Corporation has decided to cease all research on G, which was ongoing at the Nest Underground Laboratory. All funding for this project has been cut, and Laboratory Director William Birkin has been removed from his post. Sender, B.E. Subject, none. Thank you for your mail, Dr. Birkin. Top Brass has expressed an interest in this evolving bioweapon you mentioned. Do not worry about costs. Our company is the most well-funded in the whole of the United States. Sender, Richard Kessler. Subject, congratulations. I heard the good news. G is almost ready. Strange you never thought to report to the research lab here at Umbrella HQ, but I suppose I can let that slide. Anyway, send over the data, would you? And don't worry, you've done good work on G, but we can take care of the rest. Jane Doyle, notice of admonishment. You are under suspicion for breaching your contract with the Umbrella Corporation. It has become clear that you have claimed ownership of the G project and have been in unauthorized contact with the U.S. military. Please respond to the investigation committee summons within 24 hours. Well, we all know how that went. Ooh, let's watch the videotape. Got eyes on the G-Virus. Going in. Dr. Birkin, you'll come along with us quietly. 
think I didn't know you were coming. This is my life's work. I'm not handing over anything. We have our orders, Dr. Birkin. I'll ask you one more time. Hold your fire! What the fuck were you thinking? Our orders were to bring him in alive! We're in, sir. But we had a snafu. Target resisted. We had to take him out. That's correct, sir. Roger that. Just the samples, then. Let's move. So those were G-samples. You know... If they had just done a proper breach in that lab, things would have gone fine. It's called a flashbang. Disorientate the targets, sweep in, immobilize, secure. I mean, yeah, I mean, you know, a plan rarely survives combat, but, like, that's... It's like the basics. There we go. Do. Freaking amateurs. Certainly a lot of uh, biohazard suits here. Ooh, high-grade gunpowder. Uh, yeah, yeah, I'll just run back to the box and put it in there, because... That hallway looks suspicious. <laughs> like, like super suspicious. Like, there's probably a bunch of lasers in that hallway as a countermeasure. Like, it totally looks like that scene in the Resident Evil movie. Oh, and then there's just a delousing chamber. Still. And this totally looks like a trap. Ah, uh, onward! Remember, Leon, no good deed goes unpunished. That's... ominous. Ugh. What the ass? Looks like their Shoggoth research is going well. Ooh, another gunpowder large. Save room. Box. Bolseo. A red oib. Ooh, and more high grade gunpowder. Can't help but wonder what you get if you combine two large gunpowders. I don't think I've done that yet. Grab that and that. And one of these. Okay. Boom, more mag rounds. Mm. 
Y ya está. Alright. Probably should have made more shotgun shells, but... Whatever. Terrarium. Nothing interesting in here other than save point. Alright. Research diary. After the G embryo was implanted in the subject, we made a 50 centimeter incision from the chest to the abdomen and began our observations. With the help of the medical team, the subject's consciousness level was kept between 15, 15 lucid, GCS 10. However, the subject's consciousness level deteriorated and further observation was deemed unnecessary. The subject was then disposed of. Breeding rate observations. The G virus was administered to subject 501. 501 mutated into G form and was introduced to a group of 30 test subjects. After 2 hours 36 minutes, it was observed that all but one of the test subjects had been implanted with an embryo. All subjects were disposed of. One subject broke down during experimentation and took their own life. D virus resistance experimentation. We administered the G virus to subjects 628 who had shown slight resistance to the T virus. The virus was then introduced to subjects 639, with whom 628 had a close relationship. 628 showed some signs of resistance, but had been implanted with an embryo after 24 minutes. T-virus resistance does nothing to stop the mental deterioration caused by the G-virus. Huh. That was easy. Shut up, Leon. Alright, now back to Ada. No, 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 no. But why? Oh. Great. It's Gherkin again. Standing that close to him. You call this thing William. Why? It shouldn't have been like this. It's Umbrella's fault, this whole mess. You're Umbrella, too. You're telling me you weren't involved in this. Yes. But we never meant for this to happen. Then tell me everything. Right from the start. You're kind of on a ticking time bomb situation here, Leon. You might want to walk and talk. You don't get away that easily. Good God, William. What have you done? So you made this monster. We made the G-Virus, but we never intended this. spin it any way you want. You're still responsible. Great. Doing? We can't let him get away. Huh? Uh. All right. 
<sighs> yeah, the attic. Ouch. Okay. Just gonna. I'm glad I didn't put all these away. That would have been dumb. Okay, running, running, running. Ah, oh, that was terrible shot. Even with the damage resistance set. Yeah. Grenades are nice. Come on now, running, running, running. I wonder if there's goodies everywhere in here. Oh! Ouch. I'm on fire. I'm on fire. I'm on fire. Ah, oh, shit. Crap. to treat a police officer. Ow. Just gonna... Grab these here. Oh, more mag rounds. Ah, oh, that was... Boop! Ow. Just gonna... Go over here. A minute. Oh, come on. <sighs> and this is an exciting boss fight. I will give it that. I can't panic. Can't do it. Panicking will make this even more difficult than it already is. Freaking gherkin. Pickle man. Attention. That reminds me. Since this is gonna be a toughie, should probably grab this. And maybe one of these. Okay. Thing is reloaded. All right. Once more onto the breach. Class A breach detected. Last until target is neutralized. Okay. I got it, I got it, I got it. I'm sorry if I came on a bit strong, okay? It's just this is my first day at work. And I'm not used to being attacked by gigantic monsters yet. I didn't realize that this was a job I signed up for. So, you know. Yeah. A little professional courtesy could go a long way, is all I'm saying. That! 
Okay, it's kind of dumb thinking I can blow that up with my handgun. Quite go according to plan. Don't quite recall the plan exactly, but it, that it obviously didn't work. Just gonna. Oh, thank God, more backgrounds. Just gonna. Uh, just gonna. Oh, first aid spray. Nice. Gonna need you to Um I guess I cleared this part out. Yep, alright, I don't have anything else to grab. is unfortunate. Chip! Nope! Neep! Oh god. Don't wanna die. Don't wanna die. Not yet. Nope! and fire. Ah. 
Yay. All right. Stay down, Gherkin. Well, you tore your mom jeans. That looks bad. It feels worse. Believe me. Talk about what you said. I don't know how much I believe. Just tell me you'll destroy that G sample. No, it's evidence. It's going to the FBI. <laughs> you trust that bitch? What's that supposed to mean? She's not FBI. She's a mercenary. She's gonna sell it. The G virus is gonna go to the highest bidder. Oh, that's bullshit. I hope you're right. But if the G virus gets into the wrong hands. If the G-Virus gets into the wrong hands, this story will get incredibly convoluted. Don't you see? <laughs> First it was the T-Virus, then it's the G-Virus, then it was the Veronica Virus, then it was Las Plagas, then it was Ouroboros, and then it was some kind of mycelia thing. You know what, I don't have time for that. This place is gonna blow. Attention. Umbrella corpse. Fnarf, fnarf, fnarf. I was just thinking about you. That makes two of us. I was getting worried. No, we make a good team. I gotta ask you something. Way's clear. Please, tell me you got it. Oh, I got it. Let me verify the G sample when we get the hell out of here. Before we do that, I ran into Annette. She claims you're not FBI. Oh, Leon. Why couldn't you just hand over the sample? I realized, as much as I wanted to trust you, I didn't. I really hoped it wouldn't end up like this. So that's all this was? I was just some pawn to you? Look, I'm just doing my job. And I'm doing mine, so drop that damn gun! I'm taking you in. Hand over the sample, Leon. I don't want to hurt you. Walk and talk, guys. You shoot me. But I don't think you can. Ruh -ruh. Well, there goes the G virus. Into the abyss. No one gets that sample now. Well, I know what happens next. Because I can see the future! And it would have been much wouldn't have been much of a franchise. If they didn't keep going after this. Don't do this. Yourself, Leon. No!
Well, that was a bit of a downer. Although I think that cutscene would have been improved by the song Battle of the Fates, or whatever. You know, the fight between Qui-Gon, Obi-Wan, and Darth Maul. Somebody do a cut of that, please. Internet, hear my prayer. Nine minutes until detonation. Who's that? Claire! Huh? Leon? You're down here too! Yeah. But the whole place is coming down. Listen to me. You need to get out. Fast. Yeah. There's a way out. We can make it. Where are you now? Claire, are you still there? Leon? Hey, Leon, you're breaking up. Forget about me. Just get out of here. Damn it. Okay. Oh, good. Another knife. Seems like an odd place to save, but I'm gonna. And with that, we'll start off the next episode on a high energy note. But until then, I hope you enjoyed the episode watching me get murdered by Gherkin for a while. Uh, I hope you tune in for the next one. It should be exciting. And, uh, yeah. Like, share, subscribe, engage on my channel, you bitches. And I will see y'all later. This is Caleb Black. Peace.